Hey, what's going on everybody? We're back with another video today. Recently, some people brought up uh, some questions regarding this topic and they weren't sure how you find out whether one keyword has more competition than other keywords. And I wanna show you a free tool that you can use where you can actually check the exact and broad search term volume as well as the number of competitors for those key phrases. So let's jump into the desktop. This will be a short video and uh, hopefully you guys get some value out of it. All right, so this is a tool called AMZ Data Studio. It's their Chrome extension. It's a free tool that you can use, at least this portion of it. They do have lots of cool stuff that you can use if you wanna pay. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna go over the free portion of this Chrome extension and show you guys how you can use it. So this is what the page looks like. Um, you can go to any of the Amazons to check uh, your search terms. We're gonna stick to amazon.com for now. So the way it works is you can enter in any ASIN here and then a number of keywords below and it will show you where that ASIN is ranked for those keywords. So just as an example, let's open up Amazon Sewing Scissors. Okay, so let's just pull up, uh, let's click over here on the right and we'll use this ASIN <coughs> to use as an example. So we're going to paste this guy here and then you're gonna enter in a number of different keywords that you are curious about. So we'll do uh, sewing scissors, uh, scissors or sewing, uh, stainless steel sewing scissors. I'm just making these up as we go. Um, let's see what some of the key gold plated stainless. So let's try gold plated sewing scissors. These are pretty long tail. Okay, so we're just gonna do these for now. One, two, three. We have four keywords against this ASIN, you, hit click, you click check now below. And if you have a lot of keywords, a lot of key phrases, it's gonna take, takes longer, but since we only have four words here, it's gonna be pretty quick. This is how it works. It has the keyword that we entered. It says indexed or not. Yes, 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 all of these are indexed for these keywords. The ranked ASIN, this is the ASIN that we entered above. It shows you the rank, so where this keyword where this ASIN ranks for this keyword. So we can tell it's on page one, it's number 12 on the first page. For this keyword, it's number 43, I guess that's on the first page, and so on. Like you can see the examples here. This is cool, it shows you competing products, which is unique ASINs that show up when you search for this keyword phrase. So if you're doing product research and you want to know you know, how competitive a certain keyword is, key phrase, this is a pretty cool tool that you can use that will show you how many competitors are for this key phrase. And then it shows you the exact search term volume and the broad search term, vol search term volume. I only pay attention to exact because if I'm targeting that keyword, I wanna know exactly how many people are searching for that exact word every single month. Sewing Scissors has 6,154 exact search terms. Um, so that's pretty cool. And you can also, you don't have to use an ASIN. If you just wanna check any any keyword at all, you can just delete the ASIN and you can you can plug in any random stuff like uh, we'll do garlic press, baking mat, glass, tumbler, Fishing, fishing jackets, anxiety, blankets. So as you can see, we have a bunch of random keywords here because we just wanna know the search term, volume, and the competing products, and this tool is great for that. So we can see the different exact search term volumes for these various products, the number of competing products, and so on. Um, so this is a great free tool to use, but the thing is you have to come up with your own keyword terms. If you don't know which keyword terms are, you want a list of keyword terms that will help you when you're optimizing your listing or you're doing your keyword research, a good paid tool is Helium 10. Um, and I'll show you how to use this 
So one of their tools is called Magnet. And I'll show you an example, um, the same keyword, the same product that we used earlier. We'll do, we'll try sewing scissors, just as an example. Hit search. Now this is great because it spits out, you know, thousands of relevant keywords. It shows you the top products for this keyword, related words, uh, the exact volume, the broad volume, and then the number of competing products. You go down and it gives you just a ton of really cool information. And this this column here, Magnet IQ score, is a literal score which they give to keywords to show the ratio between search volume and competition. So the higher the Magnet IQ score is, um, the better. That means there's, there's more searches more search volume, but less competition for this. So just like the AMZ Data Studio Chrome extension, you get like a lot of the same information, but this produces all of the relevant keywords for you. Shows you the competing products, even shows you how much you should give away every, if you're doing a launch, CPR, total giveaways, um, daily giveaways. And then it shows you if they have an Amazon choice badge for this particular keyword. Um, so what's cool about this is like, if you're creating your listing, you can download this entire list and throw it into their listing optimization tool. Uh, where is it? Right here, Scribbles Listing Optimizer. When you're writing up your listing, it will show you if you're utilizing all of the correct keywords. So that's one way you can check all this stuff. Another way is the reverse ASIN tool. So just copy the ASIN and go to Cerebro, reverse ASIN lookup. It will show you if you have like a really high producing, uh, if you have a competitor that has a really good BSR, they're, they're doing a lot of sales and you're wondering how they're, how they're getting their organic sales, like where are they ranked, how are they producing. Um, you can just enter in the ASIN here and then do reverse search. Once again, it spits out a list of keywords that that this ASIN is generating most of its sales from. So knitting scissors, embroidery scissors, stork embroidery scissors, and then it gives you all the exact search term volumes. This is so, so helpful because it's impossible to think up every single related keyword phrase for a product, but this software just does it for you. Um, and then all of this you can implement into your listing so that you are indexed and ready to compete against some of the guys who are doing you know, the top sales for whatever niche you're in. Anyway, that's it for the video, guys. I just wanted to show an example of a free tool that you can use to check search term volumes and competing products, as well as a paid version, Helium 10. This is like a must-have tool for keyword research, and they've got a bunch of other stuff. If you guys want access to this, I believe they do 30-day free trial. I'll leave a link in the description if you guys want to check that out. Highly recommend it. I use it almost every single day. Thanks so much for watching guys. Please like and subscribe and stay tuned for more awesome content coming out soon. Thanks.